Hello everyone, welcome back to another session by K21 Academy and today our expert trainer will be discussing about why to learn cloud migration. So watch the video till the end. The first question would be like, I'm learning cloud which in itself is a fir uh, new technology, uh, at least probably because I don't have any exposure uh, on cloud. So it looks anything that we learn new is the latest and greatest technology, right? So the first and foremost question that you would get is why do I need to learn a cloud migration is not uh, is, is a certification AWS certified associate or professional DevOps professional Kubernetes is the certification not enough uh, that's good enough for me to get a good package of like 15 to 20 lakhs per annum with few years of experience and I have a stable job for the next 15 to 20 years why again I have to take something on my head um, struggle my way up learning a new technology or new stream at least guys uh, the truth is every person who's coming out of college these days has at least one or two cloud certification okay that's the hard truth just having a certification does not mean that they know their stuff or just because having a certificate doesn't guarantee them a job everybody has a certification these days but what makes you stand out as something that not a lot of people have what is that something that not a lot of people have migration is a very good example of that where there are 100 AWS certified architects or associates but there would be only 10 who knows how to migrate their workloads from on-premise to cloud or Azure to AWS AWS to Azure GCP to Oracle any of those sort for uh, an example so it is good to have this niche skill so that that makes you stand out in your interviews in demanding a better pay and of course for a long and extended career uh, that can span at least for the next 10 to 15 years because now it's almost like the wave of cloud migration has hit the market okay and very honestly uh, speaking i will not be explaining or just reading out these slides because market numbers will always change it is always there uh, for two months later the numbers are going to change so it's just a uh, to give you a just on how much is the market for cloud computing or migration and which at the end of the day it simply means that listen this is a huge market and you have a great potential to shine and grow learn cloud whether it is migration or aws or azure it's cloud it's it's booming uh, technology and that's here to stay for some years now okay you've decided to learn cloud and obviously you because you want to learn migration what do i learn or where do i start with that's the problem everybody tells me to learn something but nobody tells me where to start how to start okay i want to learn aws but there are 10 certification in aws 11 certification something which one is the right one for me no clue nobody tells you that so in the cloud market aws is the leading uh, vendor or leading provider for the last 11 to 12 years ever since uh, they hit the market in 2006 it's almost like 15 to 16 years now but this gartner uh, ratings have been published for the last 12 years aws has been the undisputed leader for the last 12 years because they came first to the market and they're also the most innovative company that i've ever known because in a year they release hundreds and thousands of lacks of new bug fixes and new features and product releases like nobody else nobody not even apple google microsoft nobody and as you can see because the technology is so hard and the, it's growing so power, so much and these guys are simply not available who the certified employable employees the cloud market is so big indian government uh, is pushing almost all the big government projects to be hosted on cloud but where do we have those many cloud engineers that's the problem now there is so much of jobs in the market but we don't have enough skilled employees to give them uh, put them in those roles and if you search in any job profile it could be the smiley jobs or knockery or uh, any indeed.com in india you search for AWS jobs or cloud jobs in general, you'll have hundreds of jobs in every geography you can think of, UK, US, Canada, India, uh, Australia, EMEA, any region for that matter. And because the demand is so much and the supply is so less, the package or the salaries that 
gets offered to these migration architects or migration engineers are also huge. Uh, when I say huge, is it in millions? Absolutely not. But at least uh, compared to a, a traditional or conventional software engineer, a cloud migration engineer or a consultant or an architect earns almost double. And these are screenshots. Guys, uh, these are not the slides that we made. These are actual screenshots from these websites. You can go check it for yourself. So guys, this was our expert from Team K21 Academy. And if in case you want to have a deeper dive, then we have something really special for you. We have our free class on AWS migration, what, why, and how to get higher paying jobs. So if you want to register for the same, then all you have to do is just visit k21academy.com forward slash AWS MIG02 and you'll be seeing this kind of interface. You just have to click on book your free seat now, select an event date according to your availability, enter your name, your email address, your phone number and click on yes, save my seat. Moving ahead, you'll be seeing this kind of URL on the extreme right. Add this link to your calendars, save it and I'll see you in the free class. Till then, keep learning.